Hey, welcome back to Skies of Arcadia Legends, folks. <clears throat> uh, during the intermission, I found out why I couldn't recruit Hans at the time. I hadn't spoken to him before about joining the crew, so I had to leave the area, come back in. Hat sorted. I also swung by Esperanza, picked up Don, who immediately joined the crew upon hearing we'd made it through the Dark Rift. And then I swapped by, I stopped by Maramba to pick up the fortune teller, seeing as I have a Sweerin blade. And we're about to go to Crescent Isle, but we've been attacked. Also found another discovery I missed on the way into Esperanza, so that's nice. Everyone just pick a target and wail on them. Hmm, maybe wail a little harder, Fina. Uh, a little harder, Enrique, maybe? Never mind. But I still don't have enough discoveries to get um, Domingo on the team. Because I, once I get back to Crescent Isle, I'll have 28. And you, ooh, stinky bugger. And you need 30. But I know where there's four discoveries that I could have made. When I originally went up to Ixataka, I didn't. So we'll get them when we go there. But for now, hey, this looks different from how we left it. Let's enjoy. Blazer find it. Let's be honest. But I have a feeling she's not willing to share that information with the world. There's no right or wrong answer to that. It's not a swashbuckler choice. <laughs> it looks a little roughshod, but we can do it up. We have the option to do up the base, which is nice. There should be. We paid them enough. Well, he looks happy. But I just went through Stone Reef to get here. Excited. Bam, bam, bam. Hey, we have a meeting room.
<laughs> yeah, you look pretty happy. Okay, so there is a... Moonfish hiding in here somewhere. Ooh, it's hiding low this time. There's way too much animation going on on her, for a girl of her age. So, we should have a pretty good crew now. We're only missing three. One of those is Lawrence, who will join if we pay him 10,000 gold. The lookout, I guess is Domingo. I don't know who the other artisan is. Hmm. Something to mull over. So we got shops and stuff down here. Come on, turn around the camera. What have you got? Hmm. Costs a little bit more spirit. But it is quite powerful. Very accurate. Low spirit. Very low attack. Torpedo. Yeah, let's get the torpedo in. Kits. Yeah, let's get the ancient cannon. Get to the stage now. We've got lots of spirit. Yeah. Got some deluxe kits would be nice, but he doesn't seem to sell them. Actually, some of these shops can be upgraded. Just talks about the girls. Go. <laughs> Didn't seem to want to let me leave the shop. The shop. Hello, pal. Storeroom in there, I think. Charm in here. Still the cupel spear. I don't know if anything worthy of note in here. Just a cannon. Go through here to one of the shops. See what's what. Osman has set up shop, and so has Ryukan. What have you got? Not a lot that's really worth going for at the minute. Well, 
have her upgrade her shop. Yes, I'll take that, thank you. Protect wearer from purple magic. There's a hint of where we're going. That this is generally better all round. Lowers her dodge, increases her defense. Same with Enrique. Got one of these for Enrique. I want everyone's defense up as high as I can go, really. I don't want to be... I'm not mucking around out there. i got some stuff in here I can sell, actually. In terms of... This I can sell. This I can sell. I want to gold again. Oh, I need to talk to him. Yeah, he will uh, he'll start forging me a weapon when his strength returns. She will remodel the um, uh, some of the buildings in a Yafatuman style. Not really sure I want to at the minute. I don't really want to speak to to the uh, fortune teller. There's the living quarters. Yeah, you know what? You can remodel the living quarters. Now I have to come back to the island some other time to get it. I believe up here there's another charm. down there. I wish, other than a mental note, I wish there was a way to keep track of everything I'd given Cupid. Let's go to the meeting room, shall we? Nice view of our island. And there's our lookout doing his job. Oh, there's a moonfish out there.
You wouldn't have been able to get any of the crystals on your own. You'd be dead. for Aika and her rumours. A <laughs> bicycle. Coming speed! Okay, let's go see what the fortune teller has to say for herself. Maybe it's another time. Don't really want to know. She's already doing the living quarters. You can do Khalifa's tent. God, that's a glorious looking ship. Friction burn! So, we still can't go above and below the Clydes. You can already see now how the new living quarters and Corella's tent look. So when we're next back, I'll get someone to do the tavern. But for now, we need to go to the Lands of Ice. So we need to go down here. So we just head south. Excuse me, Crescent Island. Out of the way, please. Thank you. So many discoveries yet to find. Fish. Are you kidding me? Right before I got the fish, and we'll be cleared out by the time the battle's over. Sigh.
Really, Aika? It's awake again. We did it. Actually, what I really need to do is find the Sailor's Guild. Start selling some discoveries. Get a bit of money. Money, money, money. So this should be the back end of. Not that, don't want to go to the Temple of Perrin. Najra just there. Okay. We already discovered that thing that's floating around down there. For anyone, uh, for anyone comments. I know there's loads that I'm missing. For a lot of this game, I was really bad at picking up discoveries. I've only kind of really remembered about them recently. God, this place is still really desperately needing rebuild. Guess it's going to take them time. I mean, I guess in game time, we've only really been gone like a day. Or two. I wonder. Yeah. Vice the fallen pirate. Now there are there are tales spreading of bad deeds. But we've not done anything bad. Mm -hmm. We're on the wanted list. That can't be right. Spice Island gets you 8,800 gold. Inverse Isle gets you 5,200 gold. The world being round only gets you 2,800. And Maroon Island gets me 5. That was the one I found outside Esperanza. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. People don't like me anymore. Maybe we should start getting some of these. He is always on the wanted list, I think. Quite a few pirates. Doesn't seem to be too bothered about the fact he just said we were wanted pirates. Not really bothered by that, is he? Hey guys, I know you're on the wanted list, but come in and let's talk. Who are you? Ah. Uh, uh. People have clearly fallen on hard times. She says pressure point massage. I think we all know what she means. She's a her. Of course, the game can't outright call her that. <laughs> this game is meant for all audiences. Oop. Turn on before you leave, Chris. Oh, hello. You look remarkably blackbeardish. Or other sort of air piratish. Let's have a fight! The 
because I know something that he doesn't know that we can do. I mean, how does he think he can take on this ship? Really? Look at the size difference. It's not like he's robbing a fishing vessel. Let's be honest. I'm going to take a couple of turns of focusing to really build everything up, I guess. You know, he's... He's not impotent. Give him that. But when something's got 50,000 HP, 2,000 doesn't really do much. Black Torpedo doesn't do any damage to us at all. That's how weak it is. Great. Let's just keep focusing on this, I think. There's something I want to show you guys, now that we have a full crew. Been ages since I've done it myself. Well, we'll have full spirit by the end of this. Does this guy not think, you know what, I'll just cut my losses and run. But then if we can go up against the Armada with a fishing vessel, maybe he thinks he can go up against the Delphinus in that little thing and win. Fool spirit! to do. Oh well. Not a great decision. Doesn't matter. Oh. I don't have a... Oh, I thought I had a special attack when I had full spirit in ship combat. Clearly not. come this far. Fire everything. I don't know why he started off doing two and a half thousand damage to us and now he's doing none. Oh, we missed. Oh. Not good firing there. Aika. Oh no, it's Fina. I can fire the torpedo. And Enrique will fire this cannon. Along with Fina's. God, we didn't even get halfway through the turn. Oh well. That didn't have the fun in there that I thought it would. Clearly I was mistaken about the, uh, the crew attack. Such is life. Hey, there's something running through the sky. I'll have to remember that's there as well. <laughs> Lots of discoveries to find when we can get above the clouds. But that's for another time. See you next episode, guys. Thanks for watching.